Blaze, come. Mike Kirkham and his service dog Blaze attempt to make this half mile trip along St. Paul Avenue to a nearby store almost every day. But twice in the past week, their trip has ended abruptly, stuck on this snow covered bridge path. I'm stuck. If you guys can come over here and like push me backwards, I can help you with the chair. And twice, Waukesha police have been called to help him out. It's unpassable by my wheelchair. The path leading to the bridge on both sides is clear, but the bridge is not, leaving Mike struggling to pass and posing a hazard to any pedestrians. You just want somebody to take responsibility for this. Yes, it's only 200 yards and it's 10 feet wide. And it's the only pedestrian route here, but 12 News has learned that the problem is the location of the bridge. Tell me about this sign. This is where responsibility ends for the city. The path is in the city of Waukesha near the village line on a county highway and directly above a railroad track and the glacial Drumlin bike trail. And no one clears it. They don't shovel this 200 yards. Why not? This, nobody wants to take possession of it. The city says it's county, county says it's railroad, and then we go back to a vicious circle. Waukesha County officials tell 12 News it's not their trail, but they are investigating and working with the city to determine who is responsible. And because they can't get across this ice and snow covered walkway, Mike and Blaze have started taking a much more treacherous route. Occasionally venturing into traffic, something police have advised against. As for the path, the county public works department says it's technically a pedestrian trail and not a sidewalk, and the county doesn't have the equipment to clear it. Mike and Blaze hope someone figures out a way to clear their path soon. And I think I might be stuck. In Waukesha, I'm Kent Wainscott, WISN 12 News. Waukesha County tells 12 News they hope to have an update for us by next week. We will keep you posted.